What's up, Maine Mafia? So we decided to go to Universal Orlando today. Horror Nights merch. We got some cups, we got some shirts. He was in the first, the very first Halloween Horror Night. His name is Jack the Clown. So would you wear this shirt though? Okay, so you have this, right? And then boom. So it's like Jack has your back. We're walking into the Monsters Cafe. Oh, look at this chair. It's alive. It's pretty awesome, actually. Does anybody know the name of this guy? He used to be in a ride. He used to come up from the water at Universal. There he is again, in all of his glory. While you're eating in the crypt, it shows like lips of the old Frankensteins and stuff. It's all red on the inside. All right, we're headed to Twister. She's actually never done this ride before. Something not right about this place. I don't know what it is. We're stopping by the Christmas shop, and I told her we could go inside if she wrote Twister, and that's what we're doing. I'm pretty convinced I'm gonna need a minion Christmas tree now. It's a Jack Christmas tree ornament. These are actually hand painted. This lady actually does right here, yay. So after a long search on Mount Crumpet, I finally found the Grinch. Wow, the Grinch is a lot hotter than I thought. Hey, Optimus, you have been saving the world lately? Yeah, we feel like really us. short compared to you. There's more to them than meets the eye. There's more to her than meets the eye. How's uh, olive oil been? She's good, she's on the boat. Oh, oh, I see. I see. What you got there? Uh, Is that what's... Oh, spinach. it's spinach. 3D. You got to eat a lot of that to get these arms right here. You can see things very good with those goggles. Am I right? Just brought up a good point that in Universal, all of these little buildings here, instead of just being a facade like in the streets of America, these are actual restaurants. Been searching around for ice cream. We finally found it. It's Ben and Jerry's. There's the Tonight Dough with sprinkles uh, for this one right here. So... It's a chocolate attack, is what I'm saying. I got a shake. Uh, this is actually delicious. It's strawberry cheesecake. got off of the mummy. I think it's awesome. You did what? You don't like it? You didn't like it? <laughs> you were you were having a good time on it. You're like, woo. No, I was not. Yeah, you were. That was I you. I literally didn't say a word. What? That was not me. Oh, well, I had a good time, and I had a good time riding it for the first time with this lady right here. There we are. Look at Kristen's face. <laughs> are we tourists yet? We gotta get our stuff out the locker. You can have my soul, Universal. As long as you give me my stuff. Yay. Can again. Our phones. It's like a life support. Look at these cool Halloween decorations. I'm sure they look a lot more awesome at night when Halloween Horror Night starts. Meow. Yeah. Hey, we got our own little house. I like this. <laughs> this is more your style. One time, somebody spilled popcorn in here, and I was like, look, like it looked like Gary was eating the popcorn. Hey, she left some popcorn for Gary. All right, we're gonna meet Patrick. Oh. Who you call a pinhead? You've been tanning a lot, haven't you? Yeah. You look kind of sunburned, Pat. I like the trunks, though. Okay, so we're hopping on ET. So this is something that used to terrify Kristen as a it little taut. No, it didn't terrify me. I was just like, what? Like, I didn't understand what he was. <laughs> These shirts are amazing. Okay, these were just released. Look at this. The future is here. So for those of you who know what ELB stands for, 10 cool points to you, my friends. I missed the ride so much. Duff me. Give me the duff. Quickie Mott. Kristen, this is Kristen. Come on, Kristen. Shut up. Hey, you never seen a shrunk in here before? I've never met one. Never, no. Yeah, I mean. Do they not have them when you Oh, you came here. Your daughter told me my hair was so dreadful. I'm trying to convince her to do the, the dreadlocks like yours, but I don't think it's working. We have similar lengths going on. Right. You know what the key is? You just need a new shampoo, you know? Oh. oh. body. Oh. <laughs> right. I would try that, but I have no body. Exactly. <laughs> hey, we got more street performers here. It's called Straight Out of Food Truck. Spokes, Maine. His name's Spokesbane? Yeah. Did you come here from way out of Spokane? What's your name? 
Her name is Kristen. Hey Kristen, the weather's nice, but earlier it was misty. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, she's got the New York twirl. Are you ready to turn into a minion? I'm so excited. I love it. Well, what vlog was that? I'm gonna die. I'm testing your memory. Oh snap! Look at this giant cannon up here. Whoa, his battery's about to die, bro. Girls, would you please just let me do this? Oh, we were just trying to keep things interesting. Come meet me in the minionization prep room so we can all get stuck. Anyway, yes, you will be turned into minions. Yeah, it's the boss man. <laughs> Some minions down here. So we turned into minions and now we're back to humans again. Look at these goggles. How do we look? Look at Optimus right on sunset. All right, we're trying to race to get to Diagon Alley in eight minutes. Run, quick. Oh, it feels good to be back. So we're rushing to get on Green Gods. Hopefully we can hop in on time. Oh my gosh, we're the last people riding this. It's so empty. To Harry Potter's vault, please. We made it. Because he's not born up, and he's not ripped What was that? The Weasley's wildfire whiz bangs. Fireworks from my brother's friend George. Accio Key. Last people here roaming through Diagon Alley. It's very empty today. All the students went to. Oh, look at these! Whoa, they light up. These uh, lanterns light up. You know the uh, extra magic hour spell? We're leaving the UK. Look how beautiful San Francisco is at night. It's gorgeous. We got Richter's Burgers right here. Oh, it's kind of. Right, there it is. Behind the scenes, Disney prep in action. We're totally gonna have to go to this drive-thru at night because it looks amazing. Good night, Universal. What's up, guys? I have a little bit of a secret to tell you. The footage you're about to see was filmed yesterday, which is the opening day of the Indiana Jones Bar at Disney Springs. So we combine two different days together, and hopefully you guys enjoy it. Here's the brand new bar at Disney Springs, the Hangar Bar. We are at the Hangar Bar, Jock Lindsay's Hangar Bar. If you people don't know the story of this place, I'm not gonna tell you because it's really long, but you should look it up because it's awesome. And our table is ready. That's a pretty cool entrance. I like it. Oh wait, can't really see on camera. You see that? Here we go. This is the first time we're ever walking in. Inside and there's some tables outside, so you guys can actually grab a seat. Oh great, thank you. Hi, it's you. <laughs> we're back. Whoa, that's a conveyor belt. Oh my gosh, guys, this is amazing. Whoa, this is like a nice little hole in the wall. It looks like he really built this place himself. Okay, best seat in the house right here. Oh wait, okay, so there's hidden stuff. We gotta show him hidden stuff. All right, so here's a quick tour on the inside of this bar area. It looks really awesome. This is the main room right here. Apparently this is an ice machine. So there's actually a, a few hidden gems around this area. I'm not sure if you can really tell on camera, but behind here is actually a poster that says the Iron Man, like kind of like an Iron Man reference, which is pretty cool. On this wall is a Star Wars reference. It's R2-D2. This is one of the posters that was uh, one of the places that they travel to in the movies. This apparently is like an insider joke where it says, you'll leave your heart in beautiful Pancot, which is like, I guess he tore the heart out in the actual movie, which is kind of funny. It's the newspaper for the crash landing at Disney Springs. This is Jock. This entire place is his bar. This is Indiana Jones pilot and he owns a snake, so hopefully we can find the snake around here somewhere. Inside the lost and found little cage here. Pretty cool. It's pretty dark, but if you come in here, you can actually see a lot of the cool hidden stuff. I hope you guys can see that. It's a little gold 
medallion. There's some sort of significance behind that. If you look really close, you can actually see, it looks like the golden monkey up there. All right, indie fans, this is Reggie's Revenge. This is apparently where they get to drink Reggie's Revenge from this little container right here. Pretty cool. I really love this sign, artifacts no longer taken as payment. So this is an underwater suit that apparently Indiana Jones wore on one of his expeditions. Here's what the back porch looks like. Pretty chill, right here in the water, which is nice. Hey, Indy, we found at the bar here. Look at this, whoa, you got a map with you? Well, you know, I have to go back to India to find the lost tourists in the lost Delta region. And we are looking for the Fountain of Youth. We found it in Mexico in the oh. Temple of the Crystal Skull. So this is the new expedition you're on right now. Right. Well, I hope you enjoy your time here at your own bar. I'm sure you get free drinks from Jock all the time, though. Yeah, I catch the way. <laughs> All right, man. Have a good night. This is awesome. This is the pilot's logbook. This is the official menu. It looks very similar to the Trader Sam's menu. Rolling boulder sliders. There's like a taco thing. With That's cheaper. Tacos. This is cheaper yeah. than the food trucks that we just paid for. This is the calamari thing. Squid. Why do I have to be squid? It's like oh, a yeah. with calamari on it. Anything goes is like the best name ever for a That's night. right. Yeah, Thomas had that today. All these different ones. Reggie's Revenge. My friend had this today. Mountain of you. German mechanic. Here. Scottish professor, aviator's flight, air pirate's mule, cool headed monkey. Okay, so that's the drink that we need right now. Here is a drink that we just got, it's called cool headed monkey, uh, which apparently doesn't have the actual souvenir mugs, just like Trader Sam's when it first opened. They just have these regular cups for now, but I can't wait till they get the actual souvenir mugs. I'm gonna try this out and see how it is, and I'll let you guys know. Ooh, it's strong, but it's so good. All right, so that was Hangar Bar, the Indiana Jones themed bar at Downtown Disney, AKA Disney Springs that the kids are calling it. So what are your thoughts um, on the Indiana Jones bar? I think it was like overwhelming first because there's so much detail. Yeah, there's a lot. There's stuff everywhere. There's stuff to see and read. That's Disney for you though. There's like hidden stuff and I was like, oh my God. But it's so cool, it's so well themed and they're like really trying hard to like know everything in there. There was a lot going on and I think that it was so early that they didn't have a lot of the souvenir mugs right. and stuff like that. But I think it's a really I cool it's concept. Almost, like earlier than they expected. So for anybody who's been to Trader Sam's, it's very Trader Sam's esque, and it really does feel like Trader Sam's. It's like so it's very hole in the wall type of bar. Also for Last Call, they did like this gong thing, which they kind of do also at Trader Sam's, yeah. uh, which is like they call for the Last Call. But they hit like this Raiders of the Lost Ark gong, which is pretty cool. Overall, I liked it. I think it was really good. I loved it. It was really nice. It was so cool in there. The drink was really uh, tasty. Like We're definitely gonna go back. Oh, guess what I got? <gasps> what? Oh yeah. Oh, you got a bun. Oh, I got so do many. That? Do you guys want one? <laughs> you guys remember that one time when I didn't record an outro, so my video just ended super awkwardly? <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. What's up, guys? And thank you so much for making it to the end of this video. Just in case you don't already know, we actually make these videos once a week on YouTube. So subscribe, you hear? And tell your grandkids. I really don't know why I do the stupid things that I do, but I do them anyways. If you want to watch last week's video, just go ahead and click the screen right now. It'll take you right to it. Or if you're on an iPhone or a smartphone, just go ahead and tap that I at the top right. If you want even more Disney magic, go ahead and follow us on Snapchat and Instagram. We're constantly posting on those literally every day. Next week's vlog is going to be sick. Like we got so much footage from Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party and we actually dressed up as characters. So I'm excited to show you guys. All right, I'm gonna get out of here. It is 5.30 right now in Orlando in the morning and I'm still up editing this video, but I love you guys and I will see you next week. Main Mafia, out.